1 Chronicles Chapter 25 Moreover David and the leaders of the army set apart for the service some of the sons of Azaph and Heman and Jeduthun to prophesy with lyres, harps, and cymbals. And the list of those who did the work according to their service was Of the sons of Azaph, Zachar and Joseph and Nethaniah and Asherila, the sons of Azaph, under the hand of Azaph, who prophesied under the king's direction. Of Jeduthun, the sons of Jeduthun, Gedaliah and Ziri and Jeshea and Shermay and Hashabiah and Mattathiah, six, under the direction of their father Jeduthun with the lyre, who prophesied in giving thanks and praising Jehovah. Of Heman, the sons of Heman, Bukia, Metania, Uziel, Shabul, and Jeremoth, Hananiah, Hanani, Eliatha, Gedalti and Romantiezer, Joshbakasha, Malothi, Hothar, Mahaziath. All these were the sons of Heman the king's seer, for exalting his power with the words of God, and God gave Heman fourteen sons and three daughters. All these were under the direction of their father for song in the house of Jehovah, with cymbals, harps, and lyres, for the service of the house of God, Azaph, Jeduthun, and Heman being under the direction of the king. And the number of them, with their brothers who were instructed in singing to Jehovah, all of whom were skillful, was 288. And they cast lots for their duties, all alike, the small as well as the great, the teacher as well as the student. Now the first lot came forth for Azaph to Joseph, the second to Gedaliah, he and his brothers and his sons, twelve. The third to Zachar, his sons and his brothers, twelve. The fourth to Isri, his sons and his brothers, twelve. The fifth to Nethaniah, his sons and his brothers, twelve. The sixth to Bukia, his sons and his brothers, twelve. The seventh to Jeshurila, his sons and his brothers, twelve. The eighth to Jeshea, his sons and his brothers, twelve. The ninth to Metania, his sons and his brothers, twelve. The tenth to Shermay, his sons and his brothers, twelve. The eleventh to Azrael, his sons and his brothers, twelve. The twelfth to Hashabiah, his sons and his brothers, twelve. For the thirteenth, Shubael, his sons and his brothers, twelve. For the fourteenth, Mattathiah, his sons and his brothers, twelve. For the fifteenth to Jeremoth, his sons and his brothers, twelve. For the sixteenth to Hananiah, his sons and his brothers, twelve. For the seventeenth to Joshbakasha, his sons and his brothers, twelve. For the eighteenth to Hanani, his sons and his brothers, twelve. For the nineteenth to Malothi, his sons and his brothers, twelve. For the twentieth to Eliatha, his sons and his brothers, twelve. For the twenty-first to Hothar, his sons and his brothers, twelve. For the twenty-second to Gedalti, his sons and his brothers, twelve. For the twenty-third to Mahaziath, his sons and his brothers, twelve. For the twenty-fourth to Romanti, Ezer, his sons and his brothers, twelve. First Chronicles Chapter 26 for the divisions of the doorkeepers, of the Korahites, Meshalemia the son of Kore, of the sons of Azaph. And Meshalemia had sons, Zechariah the firstborn, Gedeel the second, Zebadiah the third, Jathniel the fourth. Elam the fifth, Jehohanan the sixth, Elihoanai the seventh. And Obadidam had sons, Shemaiah the firstborn, Jehazabad the second, Joah the third and Sacher the fourth and Nethanel the fifth. Amiel the sixth, Issachar the seventh, Pulathai the eighth, for God blessed him. And to Shemaiah his son were sons born, 
who ruled over the house of their father, for they were mighty men of valor. The sons of Shemaiah, Othni and Rephael and Obed and Elzabad, whose brothers, Elihu and Semechiah, were valiant men. All these were among the sons of Obed-Edom, they and their sons and their brothers, men of strength able for the service, sixty-two of Obed-Edom. And Meshalemia had sons and brothers, valiant men, eighteen. And Hosea, of the children of Merari, had sons, Shimri the chief, for although he was not the firstborn, his father made him chief. Hilkiah the second, Tebaliah the third, Zechariah the fourth, all the sons and brothers of Hosea were thirteen. To these divisions of the doorkeepers, the chief men, were given duties like those of their brothers, to minister in the house of Jehovah. And they cast lots, the small as well as the great, according to their fathers' houses, for every gate. And the lot for the east fell to Shelemiah. Then for Zechariah his son, a counselor with insight, they cast lots, and his lot went out for the north. For Obed-Edom it went out for the south, and for his sons it went out for the storehouse. For Shepim and Hosea it went out for the west, by the gate of Shalcheth on the ascending road. Guard corresponded to guard. On the east, six Levites, on the north, for a day, on the south, for a day, and for the storehouse, two by two. At the colonnade to the west, four at the road and two at the colonnade. These were the divisions of the doorkeepers, from the sons of the Korahites and from the sons of Merari. And of the Levites, Ahijah was over the treasures of the house of God and over the treasures of the dedicated gifts. The sons of Laden, the sons of the Gershonites belonging to Laden, the heads of the Fathers houses belonging to Laden the Gershonite, Jehili. The sons of Jehili, Zetham and Joel his brother, who were over the treasures of the house of Jehovah. Of the Amramites, the Izzarites, the Hebronites, and the Uzzielites. Shabul the son of Gershom, the son of Moses, was ruler over the treasures. And his brothers, from Eliezer came Rehabiah his son and Jeshea his son and Joram his son and Zikri his son and Shelomoth his son. This Shelomoth and his brothers were over all the treasures of the dedicated gifts, which David the king and the heads of the Fathers' houses, the captains over thousands and hundreds and the captains of the army, had dedicated. Out of the spoil won in battles they dedicated these to repair the house of Jehovah. And all that Samuel the seer and Saul the son of Kish and Abner the son of Ne and Joab the son of Zeruiah had dedicated, and whoever had dedicated anything, was under the hand of Shelomoth and his brothers. Of the Israelites, Shenaniah and his sons were appointed to the outward duties over Israel, as officers and judges. Of the Hebronites, Hashabiah and his brothers, men of valor, one thousand seven hundred, had the oversight of Israel beyond the Jordan to the west for all the business of Jehovah, and for the service of the king. Of the Hebronites, Jerija was chief. As for the Hebronites, in the fortieth year of David's reign a search was made according to their generations by Fathers' houses, and among them mighty men of valor were found at Jazagilead. And his brothers, men of valor, were two thousand seven hundred, heads of Fathers' houses, whom King David made overseers over the Reubenites and the Gadites and the half-tribe of the Manassites, for every matter pertaining to God and for the affairs of the king. 1 Chronicles Chapter 27 And these are the children of Israel by their number, the heads of Fathers' houses, and the captains of thousands and of hundreds, and their officers who served the king in all the matters of the divisions that came in and went out month by month throughout all the months of the year, for every division there were twenty-four thousand. Over the first division for the first month was Jashabim the son of Zabdiel, 
and in his division were twenty-four thousand. He was from the children of Perez, the chief of all the captains of the army for the first month. And over the division of the second month was Dodai the Ahohite in his division, with Mikloth being the leader, and in his division were twenty-four thousand. The third captain of the army for the third month was Benaiah the chief, the son of Jehoiada the priest, and in his division were twenty-four thousand. This is that Benaiah who was the mighty man of the thirty and who was over the thirty, and in his division was Amizabad his son. The fourth for the fourth month was Asahel the brother of Joab and Zebediah his son after him, and in his division were twenty-four thousand. The fifth for this fifth month was the captain Shamhath the Israhite, and in his division were twenty-four thousand. The sixth for the sixth month was Ira the son of Ikesh the Tekoite, and in his division were twenty-four thousand. The seventh for the seventh month was Helez the Pelonite, from the children of Ephraim, and in his division were twenty-four thousand. The eighth for the eighth month was Sibakai the Hushathite, from the Zerahites, and in his division were twenty-four thousand. The ninth for the ninth month was Abizer the Anathathite, from the Benjamites, and in his division were twenty-four thousand. The tenth for the tenth month was Maharai the Netophathite, from the Zerahites, and in his division were twenty-four thousand. The eleventh for the eleventh month was Benaiah the Pirathonite, from the children of Ephraim, and in his division were twenty-four thousand. The twelfth for the twelfth month was Heldai the Netophathite, of Othniel, and in his division were twenty-four thousand. And over the tribes of Israel were these, for the Reubenites was Eliezer the son of Zikri, the leader, for the Simonites, Shephatiah the son of Makkah. For Levi, Hashabiah the son of Kemuel, for Aaron, Zadok. For Judah, Elihu, one of the brothers of David, for Issachar, Omri the son of Michael. For Zebulun, Ishmael the son of Obadiah, for Naphtali, Jeremoth the son of Azrael. For the children of Ephraim, Hosea the son of Azaziah, for the half-tribe of Manasseh, Joel the son of Padiah. For the other half of Manasseh, in Gilead, Ido the son of Zechariah, for Benjamin, Jezel the son of Abner. For Dan, Azrael the son of Jerahem. These were the captains of the tribes of Israel. But David did not take the number of those from twenty years old and under, because Jehovah had said he would increase Israel like the stars of heaven. Joab the son of Zeruiah had begun to number them but did not finish, and because of this, wrath came upon Israel. Nor was the number put into the account in the chronicles of King David. And over the king's treasures was Asmaveth the son of Adiel, and over the treasures in the fields, in the cities, and in the villages and in the towers was Jonathan the son of Uzziah. And over those who did the work of the field for tilling the ground was Ezri the son of Caleb. And over the vineyards was Shermay the Ramathite, and over the produce of the vineyards in the wine cellars was Zabdi the Shifmite. And over the olive trees and the sycamore trees that were in the lowland was Balhanan the Gedarite, and over the oil stores was Josh. And over the cattle that grazed in Sharon was Shitri the Sharonite, and over the cattle that were in the valleys was Shaphat the son of Adlai. And over the camels was Obel the Ishmaelite, and over the asses was Jediah the Moranathite, and over the flocks was Jazais the Hagrite. All these were the overseers of the property that belonged to King David. In addition, Jonathan, David's uncle, was a counselor, a man of understanding, and a scribe, and Jehiel the son of Hakmoni was with the king's sons. And Ahithophel was the king's counselor and Hushai the Archite was the king's friend. And after Ahithophel was Jehoiada the son of Benaiah, then Abiathar, and the captain of the king's army was Joab.